friends! Welcome back to another episode of Tic Tac Dot Story Time with me, Steffi. Thank you for joining with me today, and I'm so excited to welcome you in today's episode. My reading friends, in today's book, we will learn different types of vet. Let us learn together as we read. I want to be a veterinarian. Please enjoy the story. I want to be a veterinarian by Laura Driscoll and illustrated by Catalina Esterferi. Dad and I are waiting to see a veterinarian or animal doctor. We brought our dog Gus. It is time for his checkup. Soon, Dr. Wells calls us into the exam room. She weighs Gus. <coughs> Dr. Wells looks into his eyes, nose, and mouth. She listens to his heart. Gus is one healthy dog, Dr. Wells says. She is a great vet. She's so friendly and gentle. I wish I could be a vet, I tell her. I love animals, but I am allergic to cats. Dr. Wells smiles. You don't have to be a pet vet, she says. There are many other kinds. Could it be? I ask us on the way home. Could I be a vet? The next day, I am at my riding lesson. I see a man wrapping a horse's ankle. Are you a vet? I ask him. Yes. The man says, I am a large animal vet. His patients are horses, pigs, goats, and more. Hmm, I think I'm not allergic to any of those. On a class trip, I see another type of vet. We are at the aquarium. There is a diver in one of the tanks. She is an aquatic vet, my teacher tells us. She is feeding the fish. Later, the vet is at the touch tank. She answers all of our questions about ocean life. Over the summer, my family visits a national park. In the park is a wildlife rescue center. It's like a hospital for wild animals who are hurt or sick. The vets here are called wildlife veterinarians. They treat and care for the birds until they are well again. Then they release the birds back into the wild. This is the best part of my job, the vet says. In the fall, my scout troop visits a dairy farm. It is a large farm with many cows. We meet a dairy cow vet. I test them for disease, she says and make sure they get good food. Healthy cows make lots of good milk. We get to taste some milk. Mmm. These cows must be very healthy. I learned so much about vets. I learned there are vets who work outside. Other vets work inside in a lab. 
The study animal help. Some vets work in schools. They teach others who will become vets. Some vets work in big busy animal hospitals. And some vets have their own small offices like Dr. Wells. I see her again at Gus Neck Checkup. I tell her all I have learned. So, what kind of vet do you want to be? Dr. Well asks me. I think it over, then I do. The cat next to me makes me sneeze. I don't know, I say. I'm glad I have a lot of choices. Meet the veterinarians. Small animal veterinarian. A veterinarian who takes care of pets like dogs or cats. Large animal veterinarian. A veterinarian who takes care of large animals such as horses, cows, goats, and pigs. Aquatic veterinarian. A veterinarian who takes care of fish and other animals that live in water. Wildlife veterinarian. A veterinarian who takes care of wild animals who are hurt or sick. Laboratory veterinarian. A veterinarian who studies animal health. Professor of veterinary medicine. A veterinarian who teaches people how to be veterinarians. And that is the end of the story. Wow, there are so many different types of vet. My reading friends, do you want to become a vet when you grow up? If you like this kind of story, please give a thumbs up. Also, subscribe to Tic Tac Touch channel to hear other special story from me. See you in the other story.